Good morning and welcome to Be Fit Live. We have a special edition of our workout today. Roy is calling it the Sweat for a Vet, and that's in honor of Veterans Day. So, Sergeant Barry and Roy, how are you guys doing? Hi, Leah. Doing wonderful. Happy Monday. How are you? Doing great. How are you guys? Good morning, Leah. Um, I just want to say how awesome is it that I get to work out in honor of veterans. So super excited for this one today. Thank you. Good, good, good. So Roy, what do you have in store for everybody? <laughs> Leah, team, BFit Nation, I'm excited uh, that y'all are excited because we have a really, really strong workout today. Uh, uh, for Sweat for a Vet, we are honoring those who have served uh, and, and, and played their, uh, their sacrifice. So we are, are going into this workout just like we usually do with, with our programming of, of a total body workout that's devoted to at home or or outdoors, somewhere that's, uh, that you can do within the confines of, of a small space. Uh, but we are adding in some new, uh, what I call your cashing in and your cashing out. So before we start our 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off, four exercises, four rounds at one minute rest in between each round program, and make those deposits of 11, 11, 20, 11 reps, 11 reps, 20 reps, 11 of our jumping jacks, 11 of our burpees and 20 reps of the air squats to cash in and make some deposits leading up to veterans dates uh, coming up uh, in, in the next week. So with all of that, make sure and stay tuned because, because we have a special plank challenge for you at the end of the episode. We will explain in full detail on how you can be entered to win an exchange gift card. So. Again, stick with us through this workout. Give me all of your effort that you can today because it's going to be a tough one and we will build up on our strength, build up on our endurance, and we will tackle this together as one team going into the week nice and strong here. So again, uh, BFIT Nation, I hope you are ready. Sergeant Barry, are you ready to go? Woohoo, I'm ready. I love it. I love it. All right. All right, let's go ahead and uh, before we go into the cashing in and into our program and cashing out, let's go ahead and, and go into the uh, dynamic stretching and then I will go into the programming. Actually, let me go into the programming first. We'll go into dynamic stretching and then we'll get straight to work here. So we're cashing in, we're making those deposits with 11 jumping jacks first off. So we're doing 11 jacks, 11 burpees. Now the burpees, we can go down to a high plank and hop back up, down, up. That's gonna be 11 burpees and then 20 air squats. Again, November 11, 2020 here is, is the idea behind cashing in on these reps. So 11, 11, 20 for the air squats. And then let me go over the, the sweat for a vet programmed uh, workout. <clears throat> that way there's no surprises. You know exactly what we're going into. And of course I will call them out with you and I will go through them with you as well. So for our bulk program, we will go for a bent over row if you have any resistance. Okay, I have a few dumbbells here. If you have any water bottles, if you have anything that you can get creative with, uh, or if you do not, let's go ahead and make that fist nice and strong here. We're gonna, exercise number one is gonna be our bent over row. So we are gonna hinge at the hips, keeping our uh, soft bend at the knees, our abs are nice and tight, nice and controlled, and those elbows are tucking back towards the sky here. So nice and controlled, nice and smooth, bent over rows for exercise number one. Exercise number two, we're gonna take it down to the ground. Now, team, I know we've done these before. It's been a little while. So we are gonna go into T push-ups here. So we will drop down into a push-up, up, and rotate nice and long, nice and big, into that T formation, down, all the way up, rotating back, down into those T push-ups. Okay, number three, we're gonna come back up to standing position and we are gonna hit those legs here for some alternating lunges. So, so some lower leg work here for alternating lunges. And then exercise number four is gonna be a side plank 
oblique twist here. So as soon as I bring you back down here, you're gonna get down on the deck here, roll out to our side, elbow underneath our shoulder, rise up to that side plank, and that free arm is gonna tuck, tuck that, thread that needle all the way through and extending all the way out. Threading and extending. 20 seconds to your right, 20 seconds to your left. That's gonna be our 40 seconds in total for that exercise. And that will round out the bulk of the program. And then we will start again at the top with bent over row, two pushups, alternating lunges and side plank with oblique twists. So <laughs> I know we have a lot of volume, so let's get to work. We have some dynamic stretching coming up first to get our minds and our bodies right, prepared, primed, and ready to work. Then we'll go straight into those cash-ins and then we will get to work. <clears throat> Again, if you're just joining us, we have 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, one minute rest in between each round with four exercises as our bulk. And we're cashing in and cashing out to round out our workout. Before all of that, let's start with some dynamic stretches to get our bodies, to get our minds nice and moving here. So we are gonna go with dynamic quad stretches, reach back with that right leg, right hand, and left arm goes all the way up, pushing those hips forward. You can feel that stretch in your psoas and your hips. So we're, we have some lower body work today. We have some movements that are going on and we are looking to open up those hips elongate the body, feel some mobility work with our shoulders, try and reach a little bit further than the last. Nice and controlled, nice and easy. And at your pace, we'll do this. About two more reps here, 30 seconds for each of these dynamic stretches and we will go on to the next. All right, let's go into reversed lunges and reaches we'll go to the top of the mat here my right leg is extending all the way back i'm dropping down at the hips my hands are coming together reaching up and extending left side for me my right leg is back i'm back at the top my left leg is all the way back here hands are together and i am reaching and extending all the way over to my right nice nice go at your own pace here again about 30 seconds of work here. You can feel that stretch in your hips. Some blood flow is starting to move to your lower body, to your quads, to your glutes. With that overhand stretch, you can feel your lats stretching out here. A few more. Nice and smooth, there we go. Last one for me. <laughs> nice work, nice work, good job. Let's go into a nice wide stance here. We're gonna go with six feet alternating or six feet lateral lunges here. So again, nice long stance here. Our feet are square and straight ahead. Our head is looking straight ahead. We're keeping that chest up and we're slowly shifting our weight side to side, pushing off heels to heel. Again, hands on the hips, hands behind your back. You should feel that stretch in your inner thigh here, getting some blood flow moving to our lower body here. Good work. A couple more because this feels really good for me. <laughs> All right, nice, nice, nice. Now we do have some air squats coming up. So let's go ahead and knock out a few reps just to get the body familiar with this exercise here. Nice and slow, nice and smooth. Again, activating those glutes, those quads. Nice, strong stance here. Keep that chest up nice and proud. You're looking straight ahead. Three more reps, two, one. All right, good job. Let's go into some hinge reaches. Feet are together. We are hinging at the hips. Our hands are extended as tall as we can here and we are hinging 
nice and easy, 45 degrees and back out. Our, and our arms are making that Y type of shape here. As straight as we can here, you can feel that stretch in your mid to upper back with those arms reaching as high as they can. And back at the top, squeeze your glutes and warm up that lower back there. Again, a soft bend at the knees. Two more. One. Nice. Okay, let's cool things down a little bit with some shoulder rotations here. Just a medium width shoulder rotation. More upper body warmth and mobility here. Forward. Hands or palms are facing down. Nice straight arms here. Medium size rotations. Two, one. Let's reverse and go backward. Nice. There we go. Now we're feeling warm here. <laughs> Two, one. Awesome work. Awesome work. Grab some water. Grab a towel. Towel off and we will get into cashing in, making those, making that deposit before we get into our workout to honor our veterans here. Again, 11, 11, 20 here. So 11 jumping jacks, 11 burpees, and 20 air squats, all right? How are you doing, Sergeant Barry? Everything ready to go? Yeah, I'm ready. My heart Three. rate's already up, I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. I like, I like that you monitor your physical activity. Love it. All right. Let's start with 11 jumping jacks, B-Fit Nation. 11 jumping jacks, 11 burpees, and 20 air squats here again. All right. Let's kick things off and cash in. Here we go. 11 jumping jacks. Six, seven, eight, ten. 11, all right, let's go straight into those burpees. All right, go ahead and end up at that high plank position. Nice and smooth, two, three, stand up nice and proud. If you wanna throw in a jump, let's do it. Six, seven, this will get your body warm. Nine, ten, eleven. Let's go into those twenty air squats. Once you get there, once you get there, twenty air squats. Here we go. Nice and easy, just like we warmed up with. <laughs> Six, seven, eight. Make sure those knees are tracking over your toes, keeping that chest nice and proud. Hands can be forward. They can be out in front. You can have them off to your side, wherever you feel comfortable. I'm gonna go, in and go with 19 and 20 here. Cashing in. There we go, there we go. Sweat for a vet, November 20th next week. We've cashed in, so let's move into our program for today. Again, bent over rows, T push-ups, alternating lunges, and side planks. So let me go ahead and get my timer started. And if you're just joining us, again, we are going right into our 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, four exercises, and one minute rest in between each set here. So I'm gonna get my timer started so we can work on our strength intervals here. Towel off, grab some water. Let's stay hydrated. All right, all right. Timer is all set. Let us know where you're watching from. I enjoy looking back and seeing all of the different comments 
on where you're putting in your work from, where you're working out from, where you're watching from, where you're viewing from. It's so awesome to see a community and a team together and working together. In 10, we will work together and tackle this program here. Bent over rows in five, three, two. All right, 40 seconds of work here. Go ahead and hinge at the hips, soft bend at the knee. And we're rowing here. Again, let's extend our arms all the way down, nice and controlled and squeeze at the top. Those elbows should be moving towards the sky here. 20 more seconds, seconds of work. Keep that core nice and tight, nice and engaged. Head is in a neutral position. Keep that spine nice and long. Five more seconds, four, three, two, one, and time. Good work. Now that's exercise number one. We'll go into exercise number two in 10 seconds here, which is on the floor for those T push-ups. T push-ups in five, four, three. All right, let's work. Go ahead and take a wide stance with your feet and that'll give you more stability when you're working here. Nice and smooth. Nice and controlled. Now a quick note here, if we need to scale down, let's go ahead and come off those knees and we can scale down that way. These will creep up to you real fast. Let's push through though. Nine more seconds here. Six, three, two, one. And time, good work. Way to push through, way to push through. Alternating lunges are up next. Woo! I am already warm. I know it's getting cooler in Dallas. But I'm glad I put on some shorts. Two, one, and let's work here. 40 seconds. Let's alternate those lunges, nice and controlled. Nice and smooth here. Again, keeping that chest nice and proud. We're dropping down that knee. It's trailing over our toes. Drop at the hips. Sit down, activate the glutes. Keeping that core nice and tight, nice and engaged. Five more seconds of work here. Four, three, two, one and Tom, good job, good job, good work. All right, we're gonna take it to the ground with those side plank oblique twists, 20 seconds left, 20 seconds right, in five, four, two, and we're up, side plank here, rotating, extending. Again, let's make sure that our elbow is directly underneath our shoulder for the best support possible. Keep it nice and tight here. A nice relatively straight line, two, one. All right, let's alternate. Right leg, right arm was down for me, so I'm going to the left. I'm up and I'm working here. Again, side plank with oblique twists for five more seconds. Keep it strong, two, one and time. One minute rest, and then we will start back up from the beginning of bent over rows, that is. <laughs> All right. Yeah, one round down. First round, we learn it. Second round, we own it. We know the drill, guys. We know the drill. Give me effort. Give me effort. A couple of cues from the side plank. And for planks in general, moving forward and then after this program, keep that core tight, keep those glutes activated and push through your heels. And that will help out a lot. All right, 13 more seconds of rest here. And we have bent over rows coming up in eight. Let's get our weights together. Let's get our 
resistance together in three, two, one, hinging and working here. Nice and long, nice and controlled. Again, we're looking to squeeze those shoulder blades together. You should feel the compression in your shoulder blades and in your lats. So middle to wide back is where you should be feeling this. 15 more seconds of work. Keep those glutes activated. Protect that lower back. Keep that core nice and tight for five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Good job, good job. All right. I know we are up and down for this program, up and down. A little bit more movement. T push-ups in five, three, two, one. All right, let's work here. Nice and long, open yourself up here. There we go. Again, let's go down to your comfort level at your own pace. It's just us and the clock here. <laughs> nice team. Good work. Again, let's keep those shoulders and elbows, elbows tucked in close to our body and extending all the way up. Almost on three, two, one, and time. Awesome. Awesome job, awesome job. Good work, good work. All right, Hello. alternating lunges. Pace. What's that? I said I like that we do it at our own pace. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. What's great about working against the clock here is that it's just us and the clock. We're not chasing reps here. We're not going for speed. It's at our own pace, at our own comfort level. So here we go. 20 seconds of work here. Nice and smooth. Nice and controlled. Take that strong stance, activating that quad and pushing up through the heel, back up top. Five more seconds of work here. Three, two, one. Awesome. Good job, 20 seconds of rest guys, we've earned it. And round two, last exercise. Side plank oblique twists. Coming up in five, four, three, two. Let's work, guys. There we go. Good work, Sergeant Barry. Good work, team. Let's keep it up. Five more seconds and we're switching. Three, two, one, last rep. All right, let's switch. Left arms up. Threading and extending here. You can feel that burn on your under side oblique. A nice rotation here, two, one, and time. Awesome job. Awesome job. Good work. Round two is complete. One minute rest. We are definitely sweating today, team. Good work, good work. Towel off, stay hydrated. Mm. Roy, you have some people tuning in and saying hello. Eddie is from Birmingham, Virginia. <clears throat> we had Marie from Benbrook, Texas. Stacy from Phoenix, Arizona. She says, my retirement home, let's get motivated and has a bunch of flexing arm emojis for you. <laughs> I love it. I love it. And I just want to take a second to say that if you guys are just tuning in, that you want to be sure and watch all the way to the end because Roy has a special announcement about a plank challenge that's specifically for Veterans Day a joint event that is for all services, all exchanges, and the commissary as well. And you'll have a chance to win 
and exchange gift cards. So be sure to tune in for that. So Roy is going to share that information at the end of today's workout. Yes, ma'am, absolutely. I can't wait. So many great benefits for a plank challenge, improving posture, flexibility, strengthening your core. So just like these rows that we are finishing up in five seconds here, we are engaging our core and strengthening our bodies. Two, one, and time. Good work here, 20 seconds of rest. And we will go into our favorite key push-ups here. It's a great variation. If we need to scale back and just, just go to a push-up, that's perfectly fine. If we need to scale and go come from our knees, that's perfectly fine as well. Take that wide stance here and let's push. 40 seconds of work here. Again, I love to hear and see where everyone is listening, tuning in from. Retirement home, one day, one day. <laughs> living the dream over there. All right. And living the dream right here, making the most of our time, the most of our Mondays, putting a set, putting aside some time to focus on us. T push ups in three, two, one, and time. Awesome job. Good work. Good work. There we go. Six more seconds and we will go into alternating lunges here in three, two, one. <laughs> All right. Way to go team. Again, at our own pace. It's just us and the time. 20 more seconds of that. Putting in some work here. Sweat for a vet. Veterans Day is coming up. Lunges in five more seconds. Four, three, two, one, and time. And that less rep in. Good work. Taking it back down for those side plank oblique twists. Let me know what your favorite exercise is from today. I always love to see that. Is it something new for you? Does it challenge you? Let's work here. Let me know guys. Let me know team. We're threading and we're extending all the way up. Keeping that core tight and engaged. Activate those glutes too. One, we're rotating in now. Rotate to the other side here. I do the little spin move and I'm on the other side. Okay, there we go. Nice and controlled. Five more seconds left. Time is flying by here. Wrapping up our third round in two, one, and time. <laughs> All right. <sighs> awesome work. Awesome work. <sighs> How are we feeling, team? How are we feeling? How are we doing? I hope you stay hydrated or staying hydrated. I hope you set yourself up by having a great breakfast this morning. Great fuel. Great food. Food is fuel. Mm. What you put into your body is what you're going to, <laughs> what's gonna help sustain you through these workouts here. 15 more seconds of rest, getting our weights together here. Bent over rows in eight, five, four, three, two. All right, let's work guys. Hinging at the hips here. Feet are a little under shoulder width apart. Again, let's keep that neck and head nice and neutral, nice and comfortable, nice and aligned with our spine here. There we go, nice flat back. Dropping that weight all the way down and squeezing all the way to the top here. Last round, best round. 
Let's squeeze it. There we go. Three, two, one, and time. This is the round. If you if you want to scale up, this is the round to do it. Keep pushing through. Keep push-ups and 10. How many can we get? How many can we get? <laughs> All right, let's go in three, two, one, and we're pushing. Take that wide foot stance for you. That'll help with stability and balance. Try and keep those hips square to the floor, going down and rotating up. There we go. 18 more seconds of work. Y'all are doing great. There we go. Keeping that core engaged nice and tight here. Three, two, one, and time. Awesome work. Oh, those aren't easy. Woo, good job. <laughs> Alternating lunges are coming up next. Again, if you have it in you in three, two, all right, let's work here. If you have it in you to add some resistance, grab some dumbbells, add that weight to your lunge. You can rack it up top if you'd like for comfort. Any one of these workouts can be scaled up or scaled down. There we go. Nice and controlled, 18. 10 more seconds of work here. Keep pushing, keep fighting through the burn. It doesn't challenge you, it doesn't change you. In three, two, one. All right, way to go. Back to the ground here. Side plank oblique twist. Let's go ahead and get ready here. Catch that breath. Nice deep breaths here in three, two, one. All right, last set here. Last set, last round. Let's make it count. Keeping that core tight. You should feel this in your obliques here. Eight more seconds and we'll rotate. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's rotate here. This is my break dancing move for the night. All right. Let's push through. Time is flying. Eight more seconds here. Nice and long. Squeeze the top. Two, one, and time. <laughs> awesome work, awesome work. All right. How are we doing, how are we doing? All right, you thought it was over yet. We have to cash out. So just like we cashed in, we have to make that deposit to cash out again. Here we go. So again, we have 11 jumping jacks, 11 burpees, and 11 air squats to cash out for sweat for a vet here. 11 jumping jacks, 11 burpees, and 20 air squats. Are we ready? I know ready. I am. All right, here we go. 11 jumping jacks here. Two, three, four, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. Go at your own pace here, 11 burpees. There's one, two. Again, if you need to end that high plank, go ahead and do that. Five, six, seven, eight, Nine, 10, and 11. There we go, finish out strong, finish out strong. Good work, 20 air squats coming up. Here we go, 20 air squats here, two. All right, nice and controlled at your pace here. Let's finish out strong here. I know those legs are burning. 
I know they're burning. Let's do what we can here. Fifteen. Seventeen. Finish it out strong. Last one. Twenty reps. Twenty reps. Good work. Good work. Push through. <laughs> Cashed in, cashed out. There we have it, BFit Nation. A lot of volume today. While we hydrate here, towel off and regroup here. Cashing out feels so much sweeter than cashing in. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's cooling off in most places, but being able to get your body moving and working and activating all of your muscles during one workout will be a quick 30 minute way to warm you right up. All right. All right, team. So I know we've hit on a lot of planks throughout these past few months here. We've built up different plank variations from high planks to low planks, side planks, plank toe touches, plank reaches. We've touched on a lot of plank variations. And so we have, uh, it's, it's a joint collaboration here with all of the exchanges and all of the commissaries here. What we are extending and what we would like is to encourage everyone to join our plank challenge, test your strength here and share any photos, share a photo or share a video of you completing a plank. Now you can, you can, you can brag for your time, share it amongst friends for a, a friendly challenge here, but mostly post it on our special event page that you will find at the Exchange Facebook page. We'll even link it in the comments or the description here on this specific uh, BeFit Live. Uh, for a chance to enter to win, for a chance to win a gift card here. So again, this is again, this is a great way to test your strength here, to keep active, to encourage friends to keep active. Not only that, but enter you enter for a chance to win an exchange gift card. We have um, we have a few people who are already testing their strength, such as Melissa Stockwell, who is a Purple Heart recipient. We have uh, Robert Irvine, celebrity chef, and I don't know if you've seen Robert, but he's fueled and ready to go. And I'm sure he will challenge anyone, <laughs> <laughs> anyone who, who comes his way. And of course we have Mark Wahlberg testing his strength as well. His 4 a.m., 5 a.m., 24 hour crew. I know he's always active <laughs> and working. <laughs> so again, we appreciate it. And again, this is your chance. Test your strength here for our plank challenges, our plank challenge with our joint collaboration for all exchanges uh, from all of the exchanges and the commissaries. So a winner for these gift cards will be drawn on Veterans Day, so November 11th. So you have between now and November 11th to submit your photos and or video. I hope you all, I encourage you all, I know I will be taking a photo of, as well. I won't be entering, but I will be planking uh, as well to just test my overall strength to see where I'm at and to see how it encourages and motivates myself. I know it'll, again, it'll improve your, your posture. It'll improve your flexibility. We're working on engaging our, our core stability here. So keep that body nice and firm, nice and engaged. And if you need some, some cues here, again, let's go ahead. The high plank is gonna be here. You want your hands and your elbow and your shoulders underneath. And you can hold this plank here for as long as you can and snap that photo while you're at it. Snap, maybe not here, but if you have someone around you or use that handy timer, snap that photo or video of your duration. You need to move down to a low plank. Let's go ahead and do that, guys. Again, elbows underneath the shoulders. Your body is in a relatively straight line here, engaging your glutes, drawing that navel back and pushing through those heels, okay? That'll give you the maximum effort 
to be able to sustain a longer plank. So that's the challenge, guys. That's the challenge, team. I know we're in for it. I know we can do it. Snap a photo and send it over to us. Again, look for the event page in the comments description and or on our exchange Facebook page. <laughs> Absolutely, Roy. So we'll get that dropped in the comments here uh, shortly, you guys. Roy, thank you so much for sharing all of that information with our customers. We know that you guys love getting free gift cards, right? Who doesn't love a free gift card? And all you have to do is submit your picture or a video if you like the video instead. Absolutely, Leah. Thank you so much. And thank you, BFit Nation. Thank you for giving me all of your effort. That's what it's about here. It's not about speed. It's not about strength, but giving me your effort to continue to make ourselves, to continue to push ourselves to be better every day. So thank you so much, team. Thank you, BFit Nation. Thank you, Senior Master Sergeant Barry. You rocked it today. Yes, ma'am. Killed it. Thank you. It was fun. And thank you. Yes, ma'am. And thank you to all of our veterans moving forward uh, and, and looking forward to Veterans Day. So, Awesome. Bye, guys. Thanks. Bye.